part two day trading video Friday 309 going into the close trying to get short this NEM at 76 I should get a fill here Moved it up a couple cents. I'm lowering it to 75. Market looks like it's going to rip. I'm canceling this. I'm looking for a long. And I'm gonna take a long on the market actually. See if I can get a fill a half. I got a fill a half, no problem. They were just waiting on me to come in. Alright, five contracts, thirteen sixty eight half. I'm gonna hold it as long as I can. Alright, so we're getting a bounce here in the minis. Like I said, I'm going to hold it for as long as I kid, I can, but what's puzzling to me is this 169.50, which is the weekly resistance level that we've been bumping against. If we get over 1369 half, we could probably get up to 70 half. Cool. There's 75, poked our head over it. Five minute bar closes in two minutes. Seventy, there we go. Back at 75. I gotta sell two up here if I can. Just reduce a little risk. Wow, I'm surprised I gotta fill because usually I don't. I'll usually take everybody but me, but you see there's enough supply out there to give me mine. Still bumping to get that against that 70. 20 seconds to the five minute bar closes. We need to close above 1369 half. Six E's moving up. Let's see what the dollar's doing. Is it tanking here? Well, the dollar's holding up. Cool, got our close right where we expected. Definitely confident in this trade. Do some quarters print.
Oops, I typed in 69, not 60. Yep. Right there. There we right go. Five and a half there we go. And That's what's up. I'm taking two off if I could get a fill of 75. Bam! Got my fill of 75. One left. The goal speculators. They'll be breaking net long position by 18,000 contracts to just under 200,000. The previous figures were for silver. So just to recap there. You know there's resistance at this 71. I'll take the rest off of 75. All right, that's it. I crushed that trade. And finally, the copper. And that's how it's done, traders. I was up fifty dollars prior to that trade, and now I'm up five twelve. Decrease of twenty two percent. I'll zoom in out a little bit. Investors are now net short. Bulls are still in control. See, usually on the weekends, institutional investors are wanting to lighten up their portfolios just in case a piece of bad news comes down and the market gaps on Sunday when it opens. So I'm going to end the video now. If I don't do another video later, have a great weekend.